tell her how to call it. It's called the confetti popper. Yeah, and the the one we had go to we had go to go with it was to do this one. You don't need to. First, you take a balloon yeah. and cut a bit off the end. Yeah, and then we put it on ah. the row one. Go and down, then, go down, go down. Lana. And you don't need to cut it. off too much. Just a bit like that. Yeah, and then we put and then we put it onto the one and then tape. And then <laughs> we put some that paper into there. And then we, we stretch it with up. all our fingers. Yeah, and then and, and then it will come off. out. And then it can wait. You need to pull it a lot down like this, so it won't just come off. Oh no, it's not in the center. After fitting the balloon on, we tie the end so it won't go in, and tape the balloon on so it won't fall off. Now, where's that tape? Can't find it. <laughs> Look. What? Where? <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> That's what that was taking a And just tape it on. Add two layers of tape if you want to make sure that it doesn't fall off. But I like to add just one. Cut the tape. And you're done. We have made our confetti poppers and we are about to release them. We have three, one, two, three. <laughs> so we still have some more. Woo! And let's round. Wow. Some more. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, it went back inside. <laughs> that is so fun. <laughs> I hope you make this at home because it's going to be really fun. They make a kind of a